Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you're using the Brave web browser, just to let you know that Brave has received an update. And first of all, the update is including the security fix that rolled out for Google Chrome, which was expected because Brave is based on that open source Chromium um, platform. And this is the weekly security update. And the Chromium engine bumped up to version 118.0.5993.88 with this point release update. And as I mentioned um, in that Chrome security fix update video, this um, update for Brave will also only include one security fix. That's all we get this week, one security fix. And we don't know what the security fix is addressing. Uh, Google didn't make any mention of if it's exploited in the wild. They didn't say if it's a critical, high, medium, low severity vulnerability. But I think if it was a critical or exploited in the wild, we would have known about it. But nonetheless, your browser is your first line of defense. So just double check it's up to date uh, because that does include one security fix. Now, you'll also see that the browser has been bumped up to version 1.59.120. And that includes a couple of fixes and improvements. And first of all, uh, if you are using the uh, crypto side of things, the wallet Web3 uh, in the browser, they fixed not being able to authorize hardware wallet connection to complete transactions. So that's a fix that's rolled out for the wallet. And then we get three crash fixes. And I always say any fix that addresses stability or crash issues is important. So three important crash fixes have rolled out. And the first is they fixed a crash when certain theme extensions um, are installed while vertical tabs are enabled. And then um, if you have disabled the VPN using an experimental flag, they fixed a crash when trying to um, open up the Brave settings. And then the third and final crash fix is they fixed a crash when accessing uh, the Brave settings on a guest profile. So that's a lot to do with um, accessing those settings and those crash fixes now have been addressed in the browser. So that's it. That's what's um, rolled out now with this latest point release update. As mentioned, that Chromium security fix, and then we get three crash fixes and a bug fix. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.